This film supplements the instructions for use and serves to aid understanding. This film is not a substitute for reading and understanding the instructions for use. It is also not a replacement for mandatory instructions or training courses. This session will demonstrate how to use the remote monitoring module. Once your web application account is connected, incident data will begin transmitting to the cloud for remote monitoring. As soon as SCBA wearers and the registered Fireground Hub and app are deployed as an incident. Upon initiating remote monitoring, the overview page displays all ongoing and recent incidents from the past three hours. Each incident, represented by a tile, provides information on active duration, deployed entry control points, apps, deployed BA wearers and standby BA wearers, offering an immediate snapshot of current activities within your organization. For larger and more complex incidents with multiple entry control point sections, each section initially appears as a separate tile. To monitor the incident in one overview, you can manually merge various entry control points to receive a unified incident report. Simply click on any tile you want to merge, find the Merge icon in the blue bar and select another incident tile you intend to merge with. This process won't impact the on-site usage or behavior of Fireground apps. To access a single incident overview, click the Monitor Incident button or double-click the tile to view the incident's map overview. The sidebar on the left lists all entry control points for this incident. Each section states the app and hub in use, its user and location, the time since the area was opened, and the number of BA wearers connected to each app. A red or green dot signifies the app connection status. When there's been no data upload from this hub in the past minute, the dot turns red. Hovering over it reveals the time of the last upload. For more insights, access the Notes section by tapping on the Notes icon. The dialog shows all user-created notes and media attachments from all the entry control sections in the incident, timestamped. Click images or sketches to view in full size. To create your notes, tap Add Note. This content will be accessible in incident reports via the Report Center and shared live with other remote monitoring users. Each team using the Fireground app has a unique team section that is mirrored in the web app. For a comprehensive view of the BA wearers currently deployed in an area, select Monitor Teams. A counter in the header of each entry control point overview displays the number of teams and BA wearers in the selected ECP. This area will also show you if a repeater is being used or whether there are any battery alarms. In this team view, you'll find the team's name, current status, and a display of all BA wearers. App users can each modify the team name in the header. If needed, you can access team notes directly through the notes icon. This section gives an overview of all monitored BA wearers in the app, showing names, selected time measurement and data like TTW, time to whistle, time elapsed, TOW, time of whistle, TTR, time to retreat, and current pressure readings. Pressure readings and alarms are sent to FG Web every 20 to 40 seconds. Should any alarms occur, the BA wearer section highlights with an icon and timer indicating the alarm type and duration since activation. The alarm remains highlighted until the on-scene app user is acknowledged or cancelled for evacuation alarms only, 
ensuring continuous monitoring during critical incidents. Web users receive an alarm notification, redirecting them to the specific incident area where the alarm was recorded with just a click. Similar to buddy lights on Airboss and Fireground app pressure bars, if a firefighter's cylinder pressure drops below a certain threshold, the corresponding pressure bar in FG Web will turn amber or red to draw attention to this status. Not all products, features or services mentioned in this video are for sale in all countries. Contact your local Draeger representative for more information. Mentioned trademarks are only registered in certain countries and not necessarily in the country in which this material is released. Go to www.draeger.com trademarks to find the current status.